I'm bored, mate. Yeah. Yeah. I wanna. Do anything we can do? No, no, no. You see, I'm, I mean, I wanna do something a bit more exciting. Mm, okay. Okay, zorbing. <laughs> Motion sickness. Okay, um, paragliding. Uh, yeah, but heights, me, it, it doesn't work. Oh, I'm afraid. Sorry, that, mate. that sort of ruins my other suggestion, which is uh, skydiving. You see, I'd, I'd love to, but I've got a terrible accident involving a cat in a parachute. I, I, I just can't bring myself to do it. Okay. Sorry. Sorry, man. I don't know then. I'll tell you what, we can do all of those things and more. How? With the American Tale video game, of course. Where do you find these games? What? Seriously? How? What? What? Well, <laughs> uh, you bought it. You did. As if Blast Entertainment weren't content enough by murdering many of my childhood favourites such as Thunderbirds, Captain Scarlet and Paddington Bear, they've now moved on to one of my favourite animated films of all time, An American Tale. The only real production value here, believe it or not there is some, is the fact that they've managed to get clips from the actual film this time round. But don't be too impressed by them because they've cut half the sound out and they've lost a lot of charm. The game is filled with six HUGE MISSIONS! All of which are crap. Attempting to follow the film as best it possibly can, but I don't remember Fivel ever emigrating to America on a pirate ship. Do you? As if six mind-numbing missions weren't enough, do well enough, and believe me, it's not that hard to. And you'll unlock one of four bonus missions, which involve such tasks as parachuting, flying on the back of a pigeon, and oh, what does it matter? They're all crap anyway. If Don Bluth were dead, he would literally be spinning in his grave. 